There is a wonderful harmony of God that can be heard throughout the universe. Recently, we just had a thunderstorm here. Distant thunder and rain. It was absolutely soul-nourishing to me to listen to those sounds. My favorite is to be at Hope Hill, our private retreat, and to sit on the front porch and have it raining, and to just sit there in the rocking chairs, put my feet up, and and listen to nature. And that will renew and cleanse and baptize a soul. The song of life, it is the harmony of God, resounding in all creation. Each bird sings the song of life, and you hear the song of life as the wind moves through the trees or waves lap the shore. Now and then, you may not listen to the harmony of life, but the divine melody, it keeps on playing in all of its purity if we will just take time to still ourselves and listen. We simply attune ourselves to the healing, recreating presence of God and in harmony with God. We are back with and a part of the harmony of the whole of God. In the quiet of solitude, you know the wonder of belonging to God and belonging in God's world. In harmony with life, you're in harmony with yourself and you find in that moment, you're in harmony with all others. Listen to what it says in the Bible. Isaiah 44, verse 23, Sing, O heavens, for the Lord has done it. Shout, O depths of the earth, break forth into singing, O mountains, O forest, and every tree in it. I pray that you are in harmony with God this day and that you're in harmony because of this with yourself and with all others.